Do me for sure, Ron. Okay. Let's see if he's uh, mm -hmm. Oh, David. Shkare for joining us, David. Okay. Simen Reish Samach Gimel. Amen. I am online, Rabbi. I, I, there is somebody online. Okay. Oh, so you're working on your own? Yeah, yeah. I just unmuted my. Yeah, okay. Okay, very good. Very good. Okay. Simon Reish Samach Gimel. Me and me are mad licking him to be my own and my boy called Hey Sifim. Sif Aleph. Tick no chamish yo. Lachol Adam neir dolog b'shambas. Some said every person should have a candle on Shabbos. Every room on Shabbos should have a candle in it. Every room that you're going to go there. It means if there's a garage you're not planning to walk in, it's irrelevant. That, that's called Shalom Bayez. What's it mean Shalom Bayez? Shalom Bayez. Quiet, 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 quiet question. You said that every room we're in for Shabbos we we should have a, a light, light light on. What about in our bedroom? Can I? Well, not, uh, not before there was electricity. We have to have a light on in there. It, it, not before there was sleep, electricity. Electricity in there. Now we have electricity, so it's not we are not trying to light candles. Yeah. yeah. Every room. Okay. The minute today is to rely on electricity for the bedrooms. Okay. Um. So. Um, you know, the thing is that today there's a hallway next to the bedroom okay. and you could have the door a little bit of open. Got it. And then automatically you're already, you know, you, right. the, the point is not, it means that there should be light in every single room. Got it. But, uh, you know, today there's a lot of, there are people, I remember people that used to be very mocked, but before Shabbos they used to put in, I saw people's homes, maybe, Till today, there are people that have like you know, like you have a plug, yeah, and you could put in the plug mm -hmm. with a little, and there's a little lamp, yeah. And I would see people that would do it for Shabbos. Every room in the house would have a plug in a little uh, something. Today, there's a few things that today there is there's a Shabbos lamp, so there's a lot of people in their bedroom they have a Shabbos lamp, so they have a light, yeah, they have a light of the Shabbos lamp. You know the Shabbos. You ever seen yes, the Shabbos yes. lamp? We we. We have Shabbos lens at home. Okay. Home. So in the bedroom, the thing with the bedroom is that people people don't like light to get to sleep. Yeah. Yeah. Some people very hard for them to sleep it's with light. So really, they turn on off. Right. So, so the, the Shabbos, there is a Shabbos there today yes, you can yeah. buy. It's the best invention from that company, right? Venture. That what's the name of that company? The 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 holy patents. The kosher patents, yes. their best invention was the Shabbos lamp. Yes. Very simple, no, nothing, you know, a piece of plastic with some styrofoam inside. And it, uh, so, yeah. So today, a lot of people are using that for the bedroom. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, yeah, I mean, that's, that's, uh, and it's a bamis, every room. Turn it on, you mean? No, the, the, he asked the question. The Shukmaruch said every room yeah. should have a light. Yeah. With no exception. Every room you're planning to use on Shabbos in your house should have a light. So so the question was, should, does it really mean that way? So I said two answers. One is perhaps you could rely on the light is coming in from the bathroom or the hallway. That's answer number one. And answer number two is that uh, the truth is I, I do see people that are mocked, but every single room should have a light. But for the bedroom, it's not convenient. Some people can't sleep with a light. So, uh, but if you have a Shabbos lamp in your bedroom, that's 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 uh, you have the best of all worlds. So that right, right, exactly. You pass it with a candle, and you can sleep with it. And it's okay; it doesn't bother. Right, right, right. But the the lights are very hard. Yeah, oh, it's very hard. To sleep. Yeah, right. Even a, even a small lamp is very hard to sleep with. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No, no, no. Well, I'll take one. Thank you so much. Well, it's really good. Not. It's really, really good. That's why I'm only going to have one. <laughs> <laughs> Amen. The last one is the lawyer yeah. caution beds of heaven. Yeah. Not that she had light. Right. The lawyer caution. There'd be a huge light. 
קוף פייג' קוף עין בייס. אני מחייב כל עוד נמשיך לעשות את הלילה, לאכול. עץ לא יודע נה. אני מדבר על זה לפני שבוע. This is not a mitzvah in their Shabbos, it's a mitzvah in Suda Shabbos. A part of the mitzvah of Suda Shabbos is to have light by the meal. That's the Diyuk in the Altar of Ezlo Hashem. Achayv kol adam k'shayich al Suda Salai l'loch l'eitz lo iraneir. The part of the meal is the pleasure of having it by a candle. Shazob akhla l'oinik Shabbos. This is all part of l'oinik Shabbos. V'ikir mitzvah sa d'loch es neirus. Neirza shayich l'eitz lo. The Iker Mitzvah is this candle that you're going to eat by that candle. And you, you explained to me la, la, last week that if Jennifer and I plan to eat a, a, at some, 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 somebody else's home, we still may be able to light the candles in, in our home uh, because to, to rely on the premise that the, yeah. the, the lights from the candle may still be there. When we come home and we're planning to get enjoyment from the kid. Yeah. Right. 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 Because the, the, the candles make that person shouldn't trip. Yeah. There's two functions in the candle. The eager of the candle is what you eat. Yeah. You should make it really nice. Yeah. The person that's careful with the candle of Shabbos will be careful to have children that are Tamid HaKachamim. שנאמר את זה צז, כי נר מצווה ותוהר אוהר, על ידי נר מצווה בו אוהר תוהר, תרודה נר מצווה, פעמס לאוהר תוהר. זה ביוטיפול פשט, זה one of the מפורשים גיב, דבאח, דבאח סז, דבאח סז, רוצה פשט נר מצווה ותוהר אוהר, תהב נר בשעבס, זה אחוי, זה אחוי. But now you went out of your way to make it a nice candle, a good candle, a pretty candle, an expensive candle, a tall candle. So you went out of your way to make it. That's not a chiyu. So through the extra mitzvah that you do, from that you're going to have toida oid. It's going to, there'll be the light of toida is going to shine in your house. Your children are going to meet them. How about if the candlelight, it's uh, fancy? <laughs> I'm not sure. Right. They'll tell you yes. <laughs> Don't ask them. Um, they'll tell you it's not. Uh, yeah. They'll tell you it's a chay look at the chiyu. In the past, in my country, they would have a goal to put on or put off a candle. That is fine. The, no, it's not fine. Uh, the goy is only good for chopping wood and putting the wood in the fireplace when it's very cold. And in countries that's very hot uh, to put on and to turn off the air conditioning. But not for candle. Now, people make a mistake. They think that the same goy that is allowed to chop the wood and put the wood in the fireplace could also turn on, turn off the lights. It's a mistake. And the goy is not supposed to... Not light candle. Uh-huh. No. Mm. because our person has to organize himself to be uh, set for Shabbos obviously if the candle is burning in a way that it's danger well if it's by itself uh, there was a, a flow of wind and it went off what are you going to do during Shabbat have the meal in the dark they have the meal in the dark When we get later in the sim, we'll talk about it right when the sun sets. The mitzvah is to light the candles. There's no mitzvah that they have to be on. The, the truth is that they do have to be by the Shas and Suda. And therefore, the there's a lotion over here that is yeah. very nice. And... The, the, uh, the, I want to read tonight a few pieces of the Shalom. The Shalom writes in the name of Rabbeinu Bachai and Pashas Yisrael. That a woman should daven at that time. That when the woman lights the Shabbos candle, she should ask Hashem for a blessing. That she should have children that will shine in the Torah. 
וזכוס נאשר בשוער תזכה לבונים בעלי תואר שנקרא אוהר. ואני קיבלתי, ואני קיבלתי, שתקרא אישה בזוי ספה מאפטוירא דראש השונה של חנה, עד ויורם קרם משיחי. I'm not sure if he means for a, child, a woman that wants a child or every woman, but he said he had a Kabbalah that a woman should read. The, the, maybe people don't know. I spilled the beans. Now you know the secret. It's an it's a unbelievable segula that he writes. Shani kibalti. Shetikro yishe bezoi sapam avtoira derish shoshona shulchana. You, you could open up a Shmuel Aleph, Aleph, Aleph and read yeah. it, or you can open up a Machzer and read it. Uh, you can read it one, one place or the other place. It's the same thing. Unbelievable thing. Unbelie- unbelievable thing. Unbelievable thing. Um, He says just to, a woman can ask whatever she wants, but a special segula is to read, to read, to read the whole, the haftoida, that you read the first, uh, not the first day of Rosh Hashanah. Huh? Can, 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 can. Yeah, that's what he says. Um, mm-hmm. Never wow. uh, very interesting. Yeah. Very, very I interesting. Like they made before. Yeah. <laughs> I don't, uh, open for Jennifer and let her read it. Yeah. 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 You, could, you, could, you could look in the magazine the yeah. first day of Rosh Hashanah. Yeah. Or you can open Tanakh, Shmuel Aleph, Aleph, Aleph. You might have did it because you bought. Yeah. So, um, okay. I didn't see it even by the Sephardim, uh, she told him. Yes, it's an unbelievable thing. Yeah. So now you know. Okay. The Yesh Mechavim. Lasa is base psilis. They make two weeks. Bener echod. Zechod. Bener ebener zeh. I'm sorry. To put in in the in the in the candle. In other words, in the a candle in the dish that's holding the oil. To put two psilis. Echad keneged zochav. Echad keneged shamar. One for zochav. One for shamar. One for zochav. One for shamar. If it's Nedish Shal Shaiva, Nedish and Chaylev, Madlikim Beis Nedish, they light two candles. Also, they also light two candles. Um, what's the Chidish of Nedish Shal Shaiva Shal Chaylev? So, first of all, it's just a different type of candle, but. Uh, if you remember when we started the sugya, there was a whole discussion about uh, about uh, the Gemara. It's not so clear that you're allowed to have candles that are made out of chelim or shavim. The Mishnah said that you're not allowed to use chelim and, and uh, you're not allowed to use chelim for a candle. But Ashkenazim say it. Sfardim say shira shirim, and they say a lot of things. Right. Sfardim say it out loud. That's why you know that. So the, <laughs> the Gemara says, the Gemara says, the Gemara says, I have to read you a beautiful piece. The Shalom who says, "Nida be'enai lahad lekanedus b'shem and dafke loik emoy shenog be'miktus mekoymus lahad lekaneir shayva shelem." 
No way. Not to use Shaiva Khail. Why? I'll tell you in a second. The Rem is Ladover, but at the Tetzavah's Bnei Yisrael, the Yikhol Echel Shemen, Tov Tetzavah. It should have said Tzavah, not Tetzavah. Right. So Tov. Tov. Kosov Balaturim Begevatri and Noshim. That uh, tough is women. Vomar, women can be tough. Vomar, the that the women, which is Yikhu Shemin. And he goes into the whole thing. We spoke about this when we started the Sugya. The Gemara says, when the Mishnah gives you a whole list of things, Adkan, Sul, Silus, Makam, Ve'elach, Psul, Shmanim. That uh, till here are the things that possible for Psul, and then for Shmanim. So the Gemara says, in other words, that Chalev, and Shava are not good shaman, but they're good if you want to use it as a psila. Some some shit is in the Rishanim hell that it means that if you want to make a wick out of it, uh-huh. how, how are you gonna make a wick out of out of Hale uh, of Rashi held that what we do today, which is that we take a wick and and we put on it the Khalav and the Shaiva, we glue it on. You take the you cook a lot of sh- uh, a lot of Shaiva, and then you take a wick, go in, out, in, out. Until you have a candle, like the candles we have today, that that's not called rashiol. That's not called. That's not called. Uh, that's called a, a wick. It's a big fat wick. So chelav and shuman is not uh, uh, is not good. And shaiva as a shaman, but as a wick, it's good. But somebody shaynim disagree with that. So lepol shechonar paskins lekula. You could like if you don't have oil. good. The shaila is because. Uh, the Rosh holds the Kula. The question is how the Rif and the Rambam held. The, the Beis Yosef said, the Beis Yosef usually had, a, whatever the Rif, there was three people, the Rif, the Rosh, and the Rambam. If there was ever a question, if two held one way, that's the way he would pass it. The question, the problem is that there is a clear Tshuva Sarif that said L'Chumra. So you know, the Rambam is not so clear. So so the, 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 the Beis Yosef relied on his Chidushim. The Chidushim is also not so clear. So, but the, the Shalos says, no, it's not true. It's not true. The Rosh was making, but the Rif was really Machmir. And the Rambam also sounds like Chumah. You're not, you're not allowed, you're not allowed to you use it. No, you're not allowed to use it. Period. Oh. Period. You're not allowed to use it. Okay, now the thing is like this. Today, the candles that we have today are not really made out of Chalim. They're not made of made of uh, Chalim. Right. They make it from paraffin. Paraffin is made out of neft, probably. Neft is 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 yeah, kosher. No, it's, huh? It's yeah, scale of nochen. Scale of nochen. That's that's different. It's fine. Scale of nochen. That's fine. Even today, even today, I want to be more that, uh, like I said, the tea lights have a chesar, even though if the tea because lights still, because they turn to liquid, liquid. not like this. If it was made out of old fashioned kale. So then it would be Lachola Deus, it would be possible for a Shabbos candle. But to, because it's paraffin, it's kosher. But we said that any liquid that shakes, you're not allowed to you're not allowed to read So uh, but the truth is today we have a lecture light. Some people might be dafka to do the, the candles with the with the, 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 right. the liquid liquid the uh, right. What was it they they I don't know what the myelin that is. Uh-huh. It's nicer. The candle is nicer. Uh-huh. Okay. The light has come out nice. He says yeah. it should be shaman. It should be shaman. He doesn't say shaman's eyes. He just says shaman. He just says shaman. What if it's uh, neft with a wick? Like That's fine. Good. Neft with a wick is good. Neft with... That's what we, we said chaylev is not good. Shav is not good. So Rashi said chaylev is not good. Shav is not good. But if you glue it on the wick, it's good. That's the machloikis. That's why the shalos says better to use oil. Anyway, there's some that say that olive oil is the best because... Okay, let's continue. I think my Bobby in Yerushalayim used to light was a plate, like a soup plate, and had like a ring, and in the ring had like a few... Wicks. few wicks. A few wicks. Very nice. Wow. Very, very that nice. That was gorgeous. Yeah. Uh, because they didn't use the electricity in Shabbos. Yeah. They didn't use the electric in Shabbos? Because the... Because the, the grid, the grid, is heating and working in the generator. So the whole the whole light in the house was from this. Oh, um, was from this. Uh, ah, wow, wow, wow. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Special containers uh, that makes it making a way that you could burn it without a wick. Unbelievable. It didn't make sense to me because they did use the refrigerator. The refrigerator is maybe they had a generator. No. No. Who shall I know? Uh-huh. 
Yeah, for sure, but... Uh, I don't know. It's a good good question. question, I don't know. You open it only when you hear the motor walk, otherwise you can open it. So let's continue. Not, we, not that much was stuff inside. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You could be moisif. It's interesting. The Alter Rebbe brings only connected zochah v'shama. Some people say that's connected ish v'isha, but the Alter Rebbe doesn't bring that. He just brings zochah v'shama. V'chaylam gam kan lahoisav al hadle gimel oidalat. You could add ki v'chaylam lahoisav al dover mechuven connected dover achim. Actually, yifchis. If you want to add, you could add. There's no problem to add. You just can't do less. But if you want to add, you could add. There's no problem. Uh, Minimum. That uh, the 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 Rosh says. How do we know that? It says in Shabbos that we have seven uh, seven aliyahs for the Torah. Why? Because we have for the Shiva Sorisim Roy in the in the in the in the Megillah Esther. It says there were seven. So therefore we have seven aliyahs in Shabbos. But, but the din is you're allowed to be moisif. Because that doesn't ruin. As long as the minimum you have seven is good. Same thing here. Even though we do two candles, one for Zohar, one for Shambor. But if you want to add, like today, the minig in the, in the, in the velt is an ongram, a minig poshut that you do for every child. So if a family has a father and a mother and eight children, they light ten candles. Right? That's the minig poshut. Yeah? Your wife, how many candles your wife though? I prepared for 15, I don't know. Okay. Just like beside your child for this, your child uh-huh. for this, I have two choices. I mean, what's, what's the connection between the man of Leos and Shabbos and, and for him? I mean, <laughs> it's a funny posse. They say because the posse says that there were seven Sorisim, that there was something special. So from the, we, we say that the seven Aliyas and Shabbos, because Shabbos is close to the king, and just like in the Megillah, we see that there were seven, seven advisors. So Shabbos, we have seven aliyahs, like the seven advisors for Shabbos. Oh, right. Okay, I mean, <laughs> it sounds funny. You could also just say seven, yeah, seven you know. But that's seven, what the Gemara says, Shiva Sarisim. One of the Sarisim is Haman. So for Haman, we... Shiva Sarisim. So, the Rosh says, but why, but you're adding. So you t- so, no, 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 as long as you have seven, the minute, same don't thing don't over here. Less than two. No, do right, but if you want to put three, four. Let's say she is working with Demito, do two at least. Right, it's a shy. I want to, I, I, I'm not, it's not clear in my mind yet. If a Shiva Bakr should do two or one, Lachayda connect Zachar Vishamish and should do two. Please do. Right. My wife also go, she has a lot of older women. She, because she likes her candles, she go like six, seven different apartments. She likes candles. Yeah, wow, very nice, very nice. Yeah. A woman that forgot and didn't light the Shabbos candle one time, her whole life she adds one extra candle. And and if she forgot two times, three times, so the rest of her life, she'll, she'll do two extra candles or three extra candles. If it was an oinus, she was in jail. She was in jail. I she light a candle there. And it's a chaloyz of connected. She doesn't have to add. Someone asked me about this recently, and, and the time is short tonight. Blina, the Sunday in my sheet, I'm going to talk about this. Some of the minik to seven and some of ten. Okay. So we, who is the where, where does this come the seven and the ten? It's coming from the shalom. It's coming from the shalom. The shalom writes. The shalom writes. Yeah, that turns on the shalom. I don't know. They had a lot of children. The Shalom writes, Loshan um, Achayit. Achayit was a it was a big mekubel. Has brought a lot of siddhas to Svarim. I will let me go back a little bit. Telas Yaakov. The Telas Yaakov brings. You know what? Let me skip. The Loshan Achayit. Amru ki mitzvah lahadlik neir belel Shabbos shuhu shalom bayis yiritzem nei shasha asha Shabbos doim al elaf hashvi. Shah Zalavana Yelo Urk Vera Kham Nizit Slavino Hadlik Nebel Shabbos. 
the 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 big Yom Shekul Shabbos Amanuchah, the big day of Shabbos is the seven thousand years in the world. Day seven thousand. And Mnei Shesibas Oyer Atzof of a Hedri Mmenu Bazoyel on Mitzvahs Chavah Lachem Mitzvahs Yishabad Lakos. Okay, because the 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 sin started with Chavah. Should she? Okay. Risa Medaktekim Adlikim Apisod Shivan Eidus because the Menorah and the Beis Hamikdash had seven. There's some that do seven because the Menorah and the Beis Hamikdash. Yish Madlikim Asora. Eilu Eilu Divilkim Chaim. They don't must all be on the table when you eat. Even if they're in different places. He says it doesn't have to be on the table. Oh! Last week I was asking does, what's the market that it has to be on the table? And the Shulchan Aruch, the Ramos says it should be on the table, but Latavki means on the table. Could be, it means just in the in the yeah. dining room. Yeah. In the dining room. Who says it has to be dafk on the table? But we last week I brought you a story from the Rebbe. That yeah. The Rebbe came to the dormitory of the girls' school, the Mochachana. And he said, he wondered, don't you know that the candles have to be on the table? Will you eat? No. Now, if that story is true, it's a very strong story. Mechi tasted that it has to be on I brought from the Kafa Chaim. The Kafa Chaim says that according to the Zoyer and according to the sto- song of the Arizal, is uh, is is uh, is is uh, 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 yeah. Mm-hmm. 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 Wrote, the wrote, wrote, the We spoke about it last week. Mm-hmm. So the Kafakim says that uh, that the, 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 the bread and the candles are not supposed to be on the same table. It's not supposed to be on the same table, he says. But uh, but uh, but here you see from the shalom Vedavka. the Vedavka, it is on the it is on the same table. So I thought to myself that maybe maybe the pshat is like this. We spoke about this. Abaya Abaya said if it be a bad smell, let him walk out of the room. Who cares? The yitzay. So Rava said, "No, Shani Omer, Lokas never shabbos koyve." Toisvus says, and we're passing like Toisvus. Then, what does it mean, choyve? It's a choyve to eat the meal where the candle is. Where the candle is. What does it mean? The it's a choyve to eat the meal where the candle is. It mean the to the extent that the shalos says that uh, even if it's uh, you would rather eat in the in the in the summer and you'd la- rather eat in the courtyard, there's a mile to eat where the candles are because of the mile that you're eating the meal next to the candles. And then the, the Gemara says that a person that kiddush. has a bad eyesight, that with kiddush, you should look at the candles. And the the the, the 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 two candles together is two fifty and two fifty is five hundred. It gives back the one of the one of five hundred that a person might have lost that week from his eyesight. Okay, so so uh, so so the sh- so we see the shalom holds as a special shaykhs to the table. So I would say like this: the zoyar the zoyar connects the the menorah to the menorah in the base of mikdash, right? A benoid in the base of Mikdash, was it there so, so people could eat on the table comfortably? No, nobody is there. <laughs> What's there? Right? So, so the, the benoid in the base of Mikdash has no shaykh. So, who be the Zoyar? The Zoyar holds that the main thing of the, uh, oh wow, Choshev and Mishnah, we're talking about Neri Shabbos Kodesh. So, the, uh, the, the Zoyar holds that the Indian is Shaloy Choshev Beit Zubay Evan. Right. So because the uh, are you going to say oh the menorah in the base of mikdash what's the shaykh shloi koshel beitz of heaven the answer is for sure the eitz of heaven is the avoid the zor of eitz and heaven and you shouldn't be nishul in the avoid the zor of eitz ve heaven okay so I'm saying it a little up here but okay. still okay. if you're saying that the candles connected the menorah in the base of mikdash it's very hard to say as a shaykh to sue the shabbos okay. Okay. in the base of mikdash in the base of mikdash they do light candles uh... that was every day they had candles all around anyway. Right. But this but for beauty, for beauty. But the the, the probably held 
that the candles in the Shabbos is only Shaloy Koshim Shum Sholom Beisa, Shaloy Koshal Beitz of the Heavens, and no Shaykh is in Suda. So therefore, and they don't still agree. No, there's no, there's, there's no shaykh. Abaya held that way in the Gemara. So what did Abaya hold? Uh, the, 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 well, so maybe so there's a few ways of learning. Maybe the Zayah didn't hold of the smile of the that what uh, it says. How do you know that the Zayah holds of that? Maybe the Zayah, or the, the, the Zayah holds that uh, that it's true, but still not a shaykh. It's to Oynik Shabbos You know what I mean? You, you don't know what the Zayah holds. If Shimon Yechai might hold. That uh, the mitzvah of Neder Shabbos is no shaykh is in the Suda. Ah, so it's, it's better it should not be on the table. But Lididan, that we, we pass in like the Gemara, that the Rav said, Shani Oymechoyva, and the Toysfus says, and we all are poiskim them and on the Allah of the Toysfus, that what is the Mechoyva? It's a chalik in the mitzvah of Suda Shabbos to eat the Suda Shabbos by the candle. And forget that's the ikr of Neder Shabbos. It's not only Shalai Koshal Beitzim Evan, but, but okay. for the Suda. So it makes sense it should be at the table. So the nicker that I did it look over the suda. If I put it somewhere else, it's not nicker that I did it look over the suda. It, uh, maybe I did it stam for shaloy koshal ba'etz ba'avet. So therefore, it's not like you could say I could do everything. I could have ala milas. There's a certain mila that should be on the table. So since we paskin, uh, we paskin. You know, whenever there's a conflict, we paskin up shas and up whatever the the nigla. So therefore. If somebody doesn't have money for wine and, and for candles, you buy candles before wine. Right. That's the next one. Yeah, but the Shaila is watch, what's the mile of Shalom Bayes? So I'm saying, according to the Zoya, the mile of Shalom Bayes is Shalom Koshal Bayes of Heaven. So therefore, it's definitely on the table. It would be somewhere else too. Okay, the Zoya holds that the Menorah and the Shulchan, the Shulchan that I'm eating the shul, is connected the Shulchan and the base of Mikdash the Menorah. So why should you mix it together? Shank and we the passing like it over, there's such a svar in the shas that the ikir is shaloy koshal beitz of heaven. But we pask in choive, what's up shat choive? That it's a chalak in the suda shabbos. So therefore, the afke, it, it should be on the table. Like the lotion about the mission shalom beitz, shaloy koshal beitz of heaven. No, that's the first reason. But we're saying that another thing is chayv kolodim shaykhul suda sa laila loch lights later on there. We hold that besides shaloy koshal, there's also. It's a mitzvah in a chalik and suda shabbos. If I can't, the iker mitzvah sad loke who nears a shayach letzla. So therefore, it is all of this story is true, but it seems like it was a true story. I don't know. That's so um, at the Rebbe story. I'm only this is this is lahaloch lemaisa. If a godel Yisrael said such a thing, now I, as I said last week, I saw in a lot of sifrim and hogim. What was that they say? The, 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 it seemed, I don't know. It was on the table? I don't know. Next to ask. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But there are the Minhogim that bring, there's someone that said, oh, but the Ksav Soifer, was Medaik, it should be Dafka on the table. But there are, we know from Gedali Sol that we're Medaik Dafka on the table. So if the Rebbe said, and he said, Rebbe said it in a very strong way, according to this story. The Rebbe said, like, don't you know? The Rebbe said it like, uh, in the, the most strong way you could say it. Mervunde, as er weislich, the Shabbos yom tev daf and shtein de licht af tish. It's a very strong language. So, um, so if the Rebbe said it, ah, so I, it's a steed in Niglach Siddis, but Nigla, I mean, in Ister, but we have to do al pian Niglach Lonu. And anyway, I have a little nagging thing in the back of me. True that the Kapachayim thinks that al pian Zoyer, they're not supposed to be in the, in the same table. And it sounds that way from the song, because the song says, Asad Ledroimo, Menarta de Stima, Vishulchan Nam, Vitzvana Orishin. But I have a nagging doubt in the back of my mind that there could be another Pshat in the Zoyer, that it doesn't must be, you know, on the table itself, this is Ledorim and this is Ledzofen. Maybe, I don't know. But that's for sure, the Kafa Chaim thinks that Alibi de Zoyer and Alibi de Rizal, they must be in two separate tables. And and it seems that the Lapoil, the Minig Ashkenazim, or I don't know by Svaradim, I didn't find any any Gedoli Sal Svaradim will talk about this, but like Sav Soifer or the Rebbe, it said that there's an Indian Dafka on the table. And I think the word is that if it's the Shloy Koshal Beitz of Heaven, it's anywhere in the room, and maybe it's Fakert, it's better to separate the Shulchan and Neurim. But if it's uh, the main thing of the candle is a Chaylik and Sudash Abbas or Fakert, it should be on the table. I think Balabatish Geret.
remember you said that a different Ashkenazim and Sephardim, you make the bracha and you light, or you light and make the bracha? Mm-hmm. Uh, then we'll get to that. I didn't talk about it. I didn't talk about it. I spoke a lot, I, and not me, maybe it was someone else. I didn't talk about it. Mm-hmm. Maybe Rabbi Lerner. Not really. Okay, let's can finish the finish off the... But, uh, before I continue, finish the sieve, there is, if you go to Tzvaz, there is a candle factory. It's not right next to the Rizal's mikveh. You know, there's a candle factory. So, uh, made for me and you, American soccer's when we come from... <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, they, they give you a tour of the candle factory. I mean, there's no candle for 59 cents there, you know. And they make nice candles back then, but they're expensive. So the tour guide says, as I'm like, sir, do you know why? When Shabbos comes in, the candles are all separate. By Havdalah, the candles, they weave them together. Did you ever notice that? Do you know the reason? The reason is because when Shabbat comes in, everyone is separate. But by the time Shabbat goes out, <laughs> Achtus, Shabbat, Achtus, we're all weaving together. The only thing is, <laughs> the only thing is, let's read the end of the Sif. Wow. The Alter says, Noigum Lahadlik, the Besak Ness is based on Aedis, Shal Shaiva Kruchin, Lazacher, Lazacher, Shazacher Visham, or Bidibarach and Amru. The Abbe Besay Toiv Lasses came. It's Toiv to make that the candles in your house should also be Kruchin, should be like the Abdullah candle. Fitamza. You're going to have more light through that. The hidden mitzvah. Anyway, it's just by the way, saying in, if the candles in the basic nesses, there used to be a, a minig that they used to add special candles in the basic nesses. As some Akron said, because the men were jealous of their wives that they're lighting candles, so they, used to, so they ran to shul and they put candles in the shul. But be, huh? Yeah, it was uh, motivated to be the familiar. I, I understand for Shlom Bay between husband and wife, but in Shul, they need a big Shlom between all the people. So, so, so they made Kruchim, special Kruchim. <laughs> but the Dalta Rabbi Shul and, and May Shoram, the guy, the, the Shaman is talking lights, candles all over the Shul. Yeah, very right nice. Is. Very nice. But the thing is, Takas are the Arpoiskim that hold that Friday night should not be Kruch. And they bring a raya from the, but the Alta doesn't hold that way. The, 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 they bring a raya from the Loshan of the, 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 the and Hilchis Hanukkah. The Ramos says, and Hilchis Hanukkah, the Ramos says, um, Vizorik Shoisim Anedis, Afilu Mishaevish, Ainle Dobkin Yachem. Avikim Medura. Afilu Benedish Shoshav is Hizorik Shaloy Lazas Kain. So the the Mogavram says you're mixing up things. It's let's do them ketoni. By Nadis Chanukah, if four or five are together, it's a Madura. So so it's not bedoim to the Nadis Amikdash. It's supposed to be bedoim to Nadis Amikdash. Besides the fact that besides the fact that you can't tell how many days is now, it's supposed to be three, four, five. Yeah, yeah. But the the problem is you did nothing. It's supposed to be bedoim to Nadis Amikdash. Nadis Amikdash would be possible. So therefore, you're not allowed to do that. But when the Ramon later finishes off, and the Ramon says that also Shabbos, Shaloi Lassus Cain, he didn't mean that. He means something else. That Dr. Moshe says that you shouldn't put candles together. Why? Because then they're going to melt very quickly, and you'll have no candles left in nanoseconds. That's probably the reason why, LaPoel, we don't do it. Why talking? You're going to say, why talking? If Kruchim is a maila. Why don't we make Kruchim? We're trying to have children to make Kruchim. We're trying to do the best we could. And, and the woman closes her eyes and says, event mit bitter at her and we And we're whatever we can do to enhance the schus that we'll have to so have children to make Kruchim. So why don't we do Kruchim? Kruchim is a maila. Let's show you that Zohar is a maila. And if it's and the and the the, the shalos says that if it's odd and if it's husband and wife, it's also because the that tamid chachamim is davening belal shabbos, so it's also a mile to have kruchim. And zocher v'shomer, zocher and shomer's connection with man and woman, everything is good. So zocher v'shomer, b'dibur echad, ish should be together. 
And, the, and they're all about Pinochim was Givaldic. So the answer is not like the tour guide said. I'm sorry, the word is so gishmak. I'm sorry to ruin it. The word is so gishmak about how Shabbat comes in, Shabbat goes out. Um, the word is gishmak. I'm sorry to ruin it. But the Lani is the The reason we don't do it Friday night is for a p- practical reason. That the Darkim Moshe says, he says, he says, there's two problems. In nanosecond, there's no half hour of, of light. And also, it's a Madura and it doesn't work for Hanukkah. The Gabi Shab is one of the two reasons apply. It's going to fall apart, but if you could make a candle that's going to last into the night and they're going to be Kruchim, Givaldic. But Lepoil, it's hard to make such candles because the more, when you have candles together, what happens? The bigger the fire is, the faster. The, when the they're candles. together and then they melt. And then, you know, like sometimes Shabbos and Ayyam Tov, when it's the summer and it's hot, there's a lot of guests, not a lot of. Not and it's a Hipsuch, it's a Gissuch, a Gissuch, a Gissuch, and then. So, so that's maybe the reason why, but Lepoil, Ruchim is a Maila, Friday night, don't. So, Bozal the tour guide Zang, I don't know. Let the good tour guide say a, a different boat. But uh, this is not the right word. Faket, Kruchim, Kruchim is a mile of Friday nights. It's a gizon, it's a lemon, it's a langi yorlach. In the center of the year, it's a small aleph, a small base. Okay, there you go. The Ebishel Halfman, the Taka, the Spus of the of the Ner Mitzvah, and the Nur Ner Mitzvah. That we have in it, that we should be zayich to have children. That lead to the and 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 if you know anyone that needs us, any woman that needs a special segula, or any family with the children to have children, or the children they have should grow up to be the So tell them the special segula we saw tonight in the shalom. A woman shouldn't do it every week. It's very hard. Don't tell a woman to do it every week. <laughs> uh, for sure, don't do it to your wife. But uh, but uh, could be mizman lizman. If you need a special segula. So uh, it's a beautiful thing to after she lights the Shabbos candles to open up and to read the Haftarah the first day of Rosh Hashanah. Maybe she'll help them. The Taka, all of us, we should have children like Shmuel, which is Daimel Lishnei Anoshim, like a Moshe Hanan together. When did she About 500 years ago. He moved to Eretz Yisrael. He was like, time of the Ari. About. A little later. It's a little later. A little later. Two types of corruption. A little later. Maybe some with. No, without, yeah, what do you think? Could there be two types of curtain where somewhere each wick has wax around it and then no, weave no, together? Where oh, somewhere is okay. a thick wick yeah, or, that's kind of like I think he means to be like, like that. Yeah, yeah, I know. I think he means the altar. I think he means because he says, no, he means like Aradam. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's what I think he means. Okay, yeah, that's what I think he means. And you have the big rapid music in the sidekick. Very good. And you're welcome. Hopefully, the work should be.